Hello and welcome to Love Lessons Lounge. We extend a warm welcome to all our new viewers and a hearty welcome back to our returning viewers. Here at Love Lessons Lounge, our mission is to help you navigate the vast ocean of love and relationships. We believe in fostering stronger bonds, deeper connections, and everlasting love. Today we're setting our compass on a very special topic, keeping the spark alive in a relationship. So stay tuned. First, let's understand what we mean by the spark in a relationship. The spark is a term that's tossed around quite a bit, but what does it actually mean? It's that initial feeling of excitement and attraction when you first start seeing someone. It's the butterflies in your stomach, the electric connection that makes your heart race. It's the mutual curiosity and fascination that draws you to each other, that makes you want to know more about each other. But it's not just about physical attraction. The spark also refers to an emotional connection. It's about feeling understood, accepted, and valued by your partner. It's about sharing dreams, fears, and laughter. It's about finding someone who sees the world in a unique way, a way that resonates with you. The spark is the foundation of your relationship. It's what gets you excited to see each other at the end of a long day. It's what makes you want to put in the effort to make your relationship work. It's what makes your relationship feel special and unique. But here's the thing about the spark. It can fade over time. The excitement of the new can wear off. The butterflies might settle down. This doesn't mean your relationship is doomed. Far from it. It just means you have to put in some effort to keep the spark alive. Now that we have a better understanding of the spark, let's move on to ways to keep it alive and burning. The first tip to keep the spark alive in your relationship is communication. Now, you might think that sounds pretty straightforward, right? But it's about more than just talking about what you did during your day or deciding whose turn it is to do the dishes tonight. True communication goes deeper. It's about sharing your thoughts, your fears, your dreams, and your feelings. It's about being vulnerable and open with the person you love and allowing them to do the same. This level of communication can be challenging and it might even feel uncomfortable at times, but it is a crucial factor in maintaining a strong and lasting connection. Imagine your relationship as a garden. Open and honest communication is like the sunlight that helps the plants grow. Without it, the garden can't thrive. It's the same with your relationship. Without open communication, your connection can't flourish. Just as a garden needs regular sunlight, your relationship needs regular communication. It's not a one-time thing, it's a continuous process. Make it a habit to have meaningful conversations with your partner, where you both feel heard and understood. It's also vital to remember that communication isn't just about talking, it's equally about listening. Listening with empathy and understanding is an essential part of communication. It shows your partner that you value their thoughts and feelings, and that you're willing to take the time to truly understand them. And let's not forget, communication isn't always about the serious stuff. Sharing laughter, jokes, and lighthearted conversations is equally important. These moments can help to keep the spark alive and remind you both of why you fell in love in the first place. So, keep the lines of communication open, share your thoughts and feelings, listen with empathy, and remember to laugh together. These are the keys to a strong and lasting relationship. Remember, good communication is like the oxygen that keeps the fire of your relationship burning. Our next tip is about maintaining a sense of adventure in your relationship. Adventure in this context doesn't necessarily mean scaling mountains or diving deep into the ocean. It's about stepping out of your daily routines, trying new things together, and exploring new places. It's about the excitement of making new memories, the thrill of discovery, and the joy of shared experiences. There's a certain magic that happens when you step out of your comfort zones together. It's like you're both characters in your own movie facing challenges, overcoming obstacles, and growing together. It's in these moments that you see sides of your partner you may not have seen before, revealing a depth of character that sparks a whole new level of appreciation. Just think about it. When was the last time you and your partner tried something new together? Maybe it was a cooking class or a weekend getaway to a city you've never visited before. Remember how it felt? The anticipation, the laughter, the shared glances? These are the moments that add a dash of spice to your relationship, keeping it fresh and exciting. Exploring new places together can also be a wonderful way to keep the spark alive. Whether it's a short road trip to a nearby town or a grand journey to a country you've both always wanted to visit, the shared experiences create a bond that is unique and special to just the two of you. And let's not forget about making new memories. Every adventure, big or small, leaves a mark in your shared history. 
these memories become stories that you'll retell, laugh about, and reminisce over in the years to come. They become part of your love story, a testament to your shared journey. So remember, a relationship is like a garden. It needs to be nurtured and cared for. Trying new things, exploring new places, and making new memories is the water that keeps your love garden lush and vibrant. So don't be afraid to step out of your comfort zone together. Adventure awaits. Our final tip for today is showing appreciation to your partner. This may sound simple, but it's a powerful way to keep your relationship vibrant and meaningful. Appreciation is like a gentle, steady rain, nourishing the roots of your relationship and helping it to flourish. Expressing gratitude and appreciation isn't limited to grand gestures or extravagant gifts. It's often the little things that count the most. A warm smile, a heartfelt compliment, a thank you for something your partner did, or even a simple acknowledgement of their presence can make a world of difference. Compliments are a fantastic way to show appreciation. They don't need to be about big things, it's the small everyday compliments that really make an impact. A compliment about how your partner looks, their skills, or even how they make you feel can brighten their day and strengthen your connection. Small gestures of love and care also speak volumes. It could be making a cup of coffee for your partner in the morning, leaving a sweet note in their lunchbox, or simply holding their hand when they're having a tough day. These gestures, though small, show that you're thinking of them, that you care, and that you value them deeply. And let's not forget the power of saying thank you. It's a small phrase, but it carries so much weight. A thank you acknowledges your partner's effort, however small, and shows them that you don't take them for granted. So don't forget to say thank you often for both the big and small things. Remember, appreciation is a two-way street. It's not just about expressing your appreciation, but also about being open to receiving it from your partner. When you both show and receive appreciation, you create a positive cycle of gratitude that strengthens your bond and keeps the spark alive. When you show appreciation to your partner, you're not just acknowledging their efforts but also fueling the spark in your relationship. So, there you have it. Tips on how to keep the spark alive in your relationship. Let's quickly recap what we've covered. Understanding the spark is the first step. Acknowledging that deep connection that brought you together. Communication. That's the glue that holds everything together. Talk, listen, understand, and empathize. Remember, it's not just about grand gestures, but also about the small daily affirmations of love and appreciation. Adventure. Now that's a fun one. Keep exploring, learning, and growing together. A stagnant pond breeds mosquitoes, a flowing river nurtures life. Be that flowing river. And lastly, show appreciation. Let your partner know they're valued, loved, and cherished. Now it's your turn. Implement these tips and watch your relationship bloom like a spring garden. We'd love to hear from you. Share with us how you keep the spark alive in your relationship. If you found this video useful, give it a thumbs up, share it, and don't forget to subscribe to Love Lessons Lounge. Until next time, keep the love alive.